Uh, you're here near the Knesset. What are your statements here today and what's the next stage? Uh, our statement here today that uh, we were a million people, more than a million people, uh, passing on the streets in rallies and in tents in the past two months, more than a million. And this uh, Knesset behind us, the Israeli parliament, is empty. Uh, it's on its uh, 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 summer vacation. And we're here to call them, go get back from your vacation. It is a, it's a state of emergency now in Israel. Uh, we don't know, we don't want another committee uh, that's just going to you know, buy some time until you know, this melts down. We want an emergency discussion. We want to open the, the 2012 budget. Uh, we, have, we want to have it reopened and rediscussed and changed according to our demands that will allow the uh, uh, welfare state to uh, begin to uh, build itself from its ruins. Now in terms of the protest, what are we going to be, see be seeing? I mean, less uh, tents? Well, it's not really up to us, you know, because uh, the tent cities just, you know, uh, uh, follow our lead and, and you know, independent cities. Uh, some of them going to uh, evacuate themselves, some of them not. Uh, there's uh, places where homeless people just build a tent and this is now the only home. From now on, we're going to focus on uh, uh, discussing and st starting to, you know, put some pressure on the members of the parliament and the ministers and prime minister himself. And we're going to do some more actions. Uh, that we yet to decide and yet to inform the public, but can I show you that there's going to be a lot of action during the Chagim and afterwards. Uh, and we're here to stay because uh, our main goal, our most achievable goal, is to you know to to to, to clear the minds and to uh, um, you know just do this walk that has been uh, neglected for so long to bring the people in Israel to recognize that they have power and they can communicate. Uh, we don't have it here in the secular uh, majority of the Israeli people. We have this in, in the Haredim and the settlements. They have their synagogues, they talk to each other, they have their own communities. We didn't have that. And we are going to uh, build and rebuild the Israeli society with hope. And this is a long, long, long term. So you're saying there's something you want to learn from uh, the way the Orthodox live with the communal uh, system? Absolutely. because. Uh, you know, they have the prayers three times a day, and after they say the prayer, and they all hang, still hang out in the synagogue and talk about what this happened and what that happened. And, you know, let's build, it, build them up as a community. And we used to have that as a, as a public, you know, a, a decades ago. We used to have a, a Beit Am, and we used to have all kinds of establishments, but we don't anymore. We become so honest from each other. We have to, do, to, to focus on two main things. The uh, struggle against the government and the Knesset, and then, you know, uh, uh, preparing the hearts and uh, re-establish uh, and, you know, bringing back the hope. You're mentioning the, uh, the, the tents that are now with uh, mainly homeless people. And there really was many people who said in the beginning that there's two different protests. The Tel Avivians who have a hard time but not so bad and the people really who have uh, real big troubles. It could be that one of the things that you're going to be focusing now is bringing them together in the same protest? I, I, think, I think it's the same problem. Uh, I, can, I, tr I try to give you uh, an example from the Hasidic. I try to do it in English. There's a rabbi in Poland who was, uh, was very smart and he was, uh, he was so smart that only two students can learn from him. And uh, everybody thought, Rabbi, why did you lower your level a little bit so that two, uh, you know, mo more students can join? He says, if I drop my level, the old lady in the forest the, who only reads Tehillim will stop reading Tehillim. And you know what, if you want to mean, um, all problems and all levels are connected. Uh, if the middle class uh, gets hurt, the, the class uh, below him uh, suffers too. And this is the main understanding that people don't comprehend yet, that we are all one social texture. Now, you, you don't want to meet with the Trachtenberg committee, the, the, the leader of the students yeah. is uh, meeting with them today. You're not. You're standing here near the Knesset. Who do you want to sit with? I don't want to sit with anybody because I'm, I'm not, uh, I'm not, you know, nobody chose, nobody elected me to, to negotiate by, uh, uh, for, uh, for his needs. Because I, I recognize only in one uh, committee, and this is the Knesset, this is the Israeli parliament. The Israeli people elected, these are 120 representatives, and there's only one chairman, there's the prime minister. And this is the only thing I, I recognize, because this is the only thing, we, it's a democratic and we elected him. And Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has established more than 20 committees in only two and a half years. None of them has succeeded to uh, do anything uh, but waste time. 
So I don't want to sit with anyone. This is our demands as a people. Million people march. 85% of the Israeli people support the protest. I, I challenge them to go to come back from the evacuation and reopen the budget and listen to the people. The, the, they're voters. This is our money. This is our land. They're just the representative. They work for us. It's not the other way around. As you said, they're the real committee uh, between me and you. Yeah. Are one of you guys, two of you guys, three of you guys, we're going to see any one of you trying to get into the Knesset to be in politics in the near uh, few years? Well, I can answer uh, for anybody else, but me, uh, certainly not. Because, you know, being a politician is a, is, you know, it's, it's a profession. I'm a film director, and I intend to stay a film director. I can do a lot of good, a lot more good stuff to the uh, protest and the spirit of the protest by making films. Uh, and this gives me power because I don't have anything to earn and I don't have anything to lose, as opposed to the uh, student organization leader. Uh, because I feel free. And I, I can stand here and say, you know, the king is naked. I can say the truth, the, the pure truth, and not be afraid of anyone. And uh, this, is, this is a, a position I feel comfortable with, and it, you know, it fits my character. I don't, I'm not a politician. I can, I can never be.